So that was my husband, the hand model, displaying the candle pedestal I made. This was a super easy project and I thought I would share it with you guys. All of the products I used are from Dollar Tree, so this costs less than five bucks to make. It's super easy and you can get as creative as you want. You will need this glass bowl, which I got from the candle section, glass candle holder, and by the way, I have already peeled off the stickers off of both of these. You will also need some super glue and finally, two packs of glass beads. I chose these colors because they matched my living room. So first, I just disinfected the glass bowl and candle holder to remove any dirt and germs. This step is of course optional. Okay, so the super lazy way is to just completely fill the bowl with the glass beads and then glue the candle holder on top. But I wanted more of a design on the outside of the candle holder, so I'm going to glue on the glass beads to the edge while alternating the color as you see here. Doing this also creates somewhat of a ledge for the candle holder so that the candle is less likely to slip off. And just a tip, when you have about at least 5 beads left to glue on, make sure you measure the beads out to make sure that they will actually fit. I didn't do that, so I ended up having to readjust the glass beads. If you do mess up, you can remove the glass beads by using some acetone. The acetone will remove any of the super glue you accidentally get on the glass as well. If you wear latex gloves like I am for extra protection, just beware because the acetone ate right through them. Okay, so now they are all glued on and we can move on to filling the bowl with the rest of the glass beads. Then, very carefully, glue the top candle holder to the bowl and place something heavy in the middle so it can dry properly. I just used a candle. Now you can display your candles without having to buy those expensive alternatives. If you decide to recreate this little DIY, please tag me in your photos so I can see them. Other than that, please subscribe if you haven't already, give this video a big thumbs up, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!